morning. Today I have a haul for you. I've got some sunscreens in here. How many do I have? I have four sunscreens that I've purchased this month. <laughs> All right, the first one, you guys, you recommended this to me and I purchased it. I picked it up. This is the Equate Sunscreen SPF 50 Broad Spectrum SPF, I already said SPF 50, <laughs> water resistant 80 minutes. Uh, this is the kids version, eight fluid ounces. It has 3.1% titanium dioxide and 4% zinc oxide. And it comes out like this. It's like white. It's slightly moving down my hand. I would say it's it's a medium consistency. It's not thick and pasty. Let's put this on. I have already been using this. So I'm not going to give you all my thoughts because I'll have a video coming. And it goes on like this. And I got too much because I always do. So we're going to spread it up my arm. I did pick up uh, the 11 by Venus Williams. One of her, the two new sunscreens she came out with this summer. This is the Game Set Match Body Lotion SPF 50 UVA UVB Protection. 9.5% zinc oxide. It is 80 minutes water and sweat resistant. 3.17 fluid ounces. I'm hoping I'm popping up the price point of all these sunscreens on the screen for you. You do have to shake it well. And I have already been using this one, so stay tuned for a review video. But it is tinted. It has a slightly, I would say, yellowish tint to it. It is a thinner formula, and that's what it looks like. And I did repurchase this one this past week, the Elta MD UV Clear Broad Spectrum SPF 46, 1.7 fluid ounces. This is a hybrid sunscreen. It has 9% zinc oxide and 7.5% octanoxate. And it does come in a pump. I repurchased because, I don't know if you can see, but my chin has been breaking out because of the move and the stress and hormones. But this comes out white like this. I can't remember, I can't recall if I have done a full review of this sunscreen. If I haven't, if I have done a full review, I will link it down below. If I haven't, I probably should do one because this is one of my favorite sunscreens. <laughs> but it sinks in, it comes out white, it sinks in, it's very nourishing. It is a natural finish to it. But it is great for acne prone skin. So I have this on this morning. And one that I picked up that I have not used yet <laughs> is the La Roche Posay uh, Broad Spectrum SPF 50 Mineral Soft Finish Lotion. And it's three fluid ounces. And I haven't even opened this one. So I don't know if this is tinted or, oh, it's still got the protective plastic on it. All right, let's see together. What is this going to be? I need to put this somewhere, don't I? I'll put it right here. Okay, it comes out white. Okay, so it's like a medium thickness. It feels like your typical greasy sunscreen. There's no fragrance. Interesting. Honestly, it feels like this one. This one feels slightly thinner. But when I rubbed it in, it felt like that. Okay. And it did, it did look like, I don't think it has a white cast to it. It looks like it went away. It has 5% titanium dioxide and 15% zinc oxide. Interesting. This is, it's for body and face. Let me know if you've used this before. I just got this package in from Biosance. They gifted me the sunshine set by Reese Witherspoon. And I've been wanting to try the Biosance new sunscreen that came out. Use code SUNSHINE25 to save 25% off your order using my affiliate link down below. Thank you Biosance for gifting this to me. It has a pouch on the inside and I open the pouch. Inside are the three products I was gifted. This lip balm, Rose Vegan Lip Balm with squalene and ceramides and algae and the Biosance sunscreen, zinc sheer mineral sunscreen with squalene and water lily, and the vitamin C rose oil with squalene, Damascus, Damascus rose extract, and crystal oil. 